This Thursday, I'm going to be mowing the backyard. One of the problems about mowing my backyard is when I get down by that gate down there, I can't see it on the viewfinder, but I'm sure I'm pointing somewhere near it, my arm seems to hit something. And that's what this is for. All right, guys, let's go on down. And I'll show you exactly what I'm talking about. And can you guys see something? Let me get, see if I get something on camera. Can you see a trail going down to the gate and back up? So when I do my butt burners. Yeah, I go down, I touch that gate, come all the way, climb these steps, go all the way down, touch that gate, come back. Am I making you guys dizzy yet? <laughs> and go back and touch the gate. I do that as many times as I can. But anyway, let's go down there and see if this tennis ball will work and I'll show you what the problem is. Well, on my way down, I'm going to tell you guys a little story. When I do my butt burners, well, especially today, so I usually poop scoop my yard every maybe three days. Well, I've been lazy on it, so when I was doing my butt burners today. I had to make sure I didn't step in a pile of poop. Okay, we're down here. Now, just your average gate, right? Well, when I put this in, I kind of made a goof. And I have this particular thing right here, this bolt, sticking out a little too far. Now, that wouldn't be a problem, right? But it is. When I mow the grass, I have to get the mower around here. And when I push the mower this way, since my yard is on a hill, when I push the mower this way, I have to somehow get the mower to turn to go up the hill again, right? And when I'm trying to turn the mower, my arm is rubbing up against this. And it's scratching me. See them scars right there? Remember the three different times it's done it. So if I figure I put a ball there, this, it won't scratch me. And this wouldn't be a problem, but my yard, my back hill part, is pretty hell to mow. Especially when the lawnmower wants to slide down on you. Alright, let's see if I can get this ball on here. Okay, I got this. You gonna let me speak? Or are you gonna let me do my video? Hey, hey! Well, what I was trying to say is, I wonder how long this is going to stay here. Is that yapping dog of mine? She's barking at Justin. Justin's out there putting stuff out for the deer to eat. But that yapping dog of mine, I got a feeling she's going to jump up there and probably grab it off. So if it lasts more than one day, I'm going to be surprised. But it should do the trick if it don't fall off. So I'll be coming through here on the mower, right? And usually I try to make my turn to go up this way. See, I mowed this part right out here by going straight back and forth. Then I try to turn the mower. When I do, I usually hit this. I don't know. See, if it ain't that I'm hitting, I'm probably hitting that one too. So we leave it there and see what happens. The last time I mowed, I wrapped my arm when I uh, did the cut in. So I do the cut in first, then I move back and forth. I wrap my arm in some galls. So I wrapped my arm in some galls, and that kind of helped me a little bit. Actually, I made sure I didn't hit it then, but yeah. I've hit that thing so far this season about five or six times. i got about three or four scars on my arm. You can see them real good here. Yeah, them are all scars where I hit it. Well, anyway, guys. I wonder if that will work. So, Stormy, where you at, you yakking dog? Oh, there you are. You gonna go after that tennis ball? Cause it was one of your toys. Don't worry, since I used one, I buy you three more. Just hoping it'll work. One of the other problems we have in the yard when we mow is walnuts. Every so many years we get these in the yard. And we step on them, they could trip you if you ain't careful. Can you see the sweat on my sunglasses? <laughs> You'd think I'd wipe that off before I turn this on, wouldn't you? Now the thing about mowing my grass back here, I like to get it a little higher. Makes it a little easier to see what I mowed and what I didn't mow. So I'm hoping by Thursday it'd be high enough to mow. Now if my back my front yard was this high, it'd be perfect, but my front yard is not hills. This is hill right here and it's hills back there. And there's Justin, he's putting up branches for me. That's good. We don't have to do that come Thursday. This fall I'm planning on firing up the fire pit again. Hoping to do a lot of work out here this fall. You ready to go up, huh? Come on, let's go. Come on, go. Stubborn dog. Hey, you're stubborn. Stubborn. Oh, you gonna lay there and take a nap now? 
All right, let's go top side and I finish out the video. I'm still doing some work on my green screen. I could get a good green screen almost flawless if it's dark out, but problem is I'm getting too much light in that window and so I gotta get me some tape. So I got some black plastic downstairs I'm gonna put on there and they take care of that problem. But I need to get a hold of some tape. For some reason we don't have any tape. Well I do, but I don't want to use that type. I'd rather use some duct tape or something. Then we'll get some green screen footage going. Yeah. So basically, today's video is about to cover up a screw. My arm keeps scratching up on whenever I mow. It isn't just a screw doing it. When I do the cut in on the rest of the yard, I have sticker bushes I have to go through too. And I do go back and cut them down, but how the ones grow and them, <laughs> I just have to stop the mower and pick out the thorns out of my arm one at a time. So if I can actually get a whole mowing job done in my back area without anything drawing my blood one time, I'd be very lucky. Because most of the time, something's cutting me. Mm -hmm. Well, guys, this is it. Leave comments. I want to bring something to your attention. I'm going to be doing lots more walking videos once I switch my times. When the weather gets cooler, I'm switching my walking time. See, I walk in the evening now. And by the time I walk, it's kind of like getting a little dark. My camera don't do well in low lighting. So, I'm waiting for better light because I got lots of walking videos I want to do. got lots of things I want to talk about. Plus, I run a site on Facebook. It's called Walk for Life, and I've been wanting to put more videos in there. But until next time, thank you very much for watching. Leave comments. Let me know what would you do with that. I could get a hacksaw and trim it down. Or maybe that tennis ball will work. But you know dang well when Stormy notices that, she's going to grab it. <laughs> Especially since it was her tennis ball to begin with. <laughs> Alright, we'll see you next time, guys. Come on. Let's get out of here.